Hello everybody, my name is Andrew from Brickmeister Z, and LEGO recently announced the third 2022 LEGO Ideas Review, and this new round has 36 different projects that are in review right now. But will any of those 36 sets get made? Well, we will find out the results from this round come in in the summer 2023, and we hope to see those new LEGO sets come in out sometime in 2024, but let's take a look at them. First up, we have the Ancient Roman Temple. This will not get made because LEGO Ideas doesn't want to approve architecture sets, simply because LEGO already has an official architecture theme. Second is Castle Dracula, and this will not get approved either because LEGO Ideas can't approve castle sets. And besides, LEGO already made official castle sets like the Lionized Castle set from last year. Third is This Is Fine, and this is based on some sort of comic, but I'll get this one a maybe. Next, we have Pac-Man Move in Display, and I love how Pac-Man and the Ghosts can be moved by turning the crank at the side of this display build. We have never got Pac-Man in LEGO before, but I think if this set gets approved, this will look perfect next to other video game LEGO sets like Mario and Sonic. So let's hope it gets chosen. Next is Carl's house from the Pixar movie Up. This will not get made because LEGO and Disney are going to release an official Uphouse set sometime in April this year. Next is The Lost City. I doubt this set will get made or not because it's a mix between a modular built-in and a LEGO architecture set. But we'll see about this one. Next is The Japanese Courtyard Garden. And just like the ancient Roman temple, LEGO Ideas can't approve architecture sets, so I don't think this set will happen. Next is the travel suitcase, and what's so cool is that the suitcase can open up to reveal a pop-up Legoland, which is just like how the pop-up book did that. LEGO Ideas hasn't done a pop-up set in a long time, but I think this set has a good chance to get approved. Next is Zelda Breath of the Wild Temple of Time. And this won't be made because LEGO already has the Nintendo license to make Mario sets. Next is the Wright Flyer. And this is an old plane that was made by the Wright Brothers back in 1903. But with the LEGO Creator Expert slash LEGO Icons vehicle set that we're on the shelves right now, I'm curious to see if LEGO Ideas ever approves an airplane set like how they approved a train set that one time. Next is Classic Thunderbirds, and this set is based on the TV show Thunderbirds Are Go. This won't be made because there is a previous version of this same set that didn't get approved before. Next is the Games Web Space Telescope, and this won't be made either because LEGO Ideas already made plenty of space sets like the International Space Station set and the Tales of the Space Age set. Next is the Golden Clifftop Temple. I don't know if this set will get approved because of the architecture theme that LEGO is doing right now. So I'll go as a maybe. Next is the Cypher Machine. This object lets you create secret messages and decode them. And I like how the functions work. And I think this will look great next to other real life objects as Lego sets like the typewriter and the Polaroid camera. So let's hope it gets chosen. Next is Sewer Heroes. The design that I like has an underground section underneath the road platform, but I doubt this set will get approved or not because LEGO Ideas never approved modular built-in sets. Next is London Underground. This won't be made because LEGO Ideas already approved the Orient Express train, which will come out sometime this year. Next is the Architect's House. And this will not get approved either 
because yet again, LEGO Ideas never approved architecture sets. Next is Community, and this will not get made because LEGO Ideas made plenty of sitcom sets like The Big Bang Theory, Seinfeld, The Office, and Friends. Next is the never-ending story. I don't know anything about it. Maybe it will go in the line of the Back to the Future and Ghostbusters sets, but who knows? Next is the Old Western Train Station. I don't know if this will get made because LEGO made an official Wild West Saloon set for the Bricklink Desire Program. And they're also working on BrickWest Studios, which will be an official rejected LEGO Idea set. Next is the Zoo. We have never got a LEGO Zoo set before, but it seems like it goes in the line of the modular built-in sets. So I kind of doubt LEGO will make this one. Next is Jaws. And similar to the Thunderbirds Are Ghost set, this same project was rejected once before. So LEGO will not pick this one. Next is the Modular Arcade. And this will not get made because LEGO Ideas doesn't want to approve modular built-in sets. Next is the House of Open Sutters. I don't think this will get made because LEGO Ideas is still working on the A-Frame Cabin set that will come out in the next month or two. Next is this cat project. I do love the build of the cat eating out of a milk bowl. And I think if this set gets made, this will go in the line of those animal-based LEGO Ideas sets like the bird set and the insect set. Next is the Lover House from Taylor Swift's song, Lover. But with the LEGO BTS sets coming out soon, I doubt this set will get made because LEGO Ideas made a few music-themed sets. Next is Jack Skeleton's house from The Nightmare Before Christmas. Maybe this set will happen because LEGO made minifigures for those characters as well as a Brickhead set. And there's actually a different Nightmare Before Christmas set that is still in review right now. So I'm curious how this one will do. Next is the Clock Tower Park. And this won't be made because it might be way too big and LEGO Ideas doesn't want to approve modular built-in sets. Next is the Alpine Reviews, and just like the House of Hope and Southern set, this will not get approved either because LEGO Ideas is still working on the A-Frame Cabin set. Next is the Mechanical Flip Clock, and I like how the mechanisms and gears work to create the hours, minutes, and seconds turn in at different rates. Maybe this will go in the line of other real-life objects turned into LEGO sets, like the Polaroid camera, but I'm hoping that this set will get made. Next is the Japanese castle, and like I said before, LEGO Ideas can't approve architecture sets, so I don't think this set will get made though. Next is the Wizard's Retreat, and I think this will not get approved either because of the medieval blacksmith stuff that LEGO already made. Next is Wallace Gromit. And I doubt this set will get made because LEGO decided not to approve the Buildable Figures project for some reason. Next is Fantosi takes the bus on the fly. I have never heard of this one before. I don't know if this set will get made because of those modular built-in sets that LEGO Ideas never made. But we'll have to wait and see. Next is Willow. And this won't get approved because LEGO Ideas doesn't want to approve castle sets. And finally, we have Dog's Fun Park. And this build has many dog games that you can interact with. I do like how the mechanisms work as well as all the different dog figures. I might buy this set if it gets approved. And it might be in the line of other playable LEGO Ideas sets like the maze set. Out of all 36 sets... The projects that I want to see them get made would be Pac-Man, the Travel Suitcase, the Cypher Machine, the Cat Project, the Mechanical Clock, and Dog's Fun Park. But these are just my own thoughts. Let me know which of the 36 different LEGO Ideas projects would you like to see in 2024. 
and don't forget to subscribe to the Brickmeister Z channel for more updates on these sets. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!